I burned a dinner. I burned the dinner. I burned the dinner. Are we fighting over who burned the dinner first? Yeah, I got this one. Huh? I'm trying to fat. The camera makes me look fat. I burned the dinner. Look, if you are gonna worry about being looking fat, Ryan, I'm sitting here like, which angle makes it look like I don't have six chins? You are not fat. The other one of us are fat. I was just kidding. The way that when you sit and then the seatbelt takes my stomach, it just looks funny. So that's why I was just making a comment about it. Let me, let me fix the seatbelt. Okay. Alright, I got it now. Alright, make sure you leave all that footage in there. No. Yeah. Why? Because then they'll know that we're human. Like even this footage right here. We are human. Enjoy our daily life. I am life. not human. Do any of you guys struggle with the same things day to day that we struggle with? Comment down below. She won't put it in there, even though I'm I'll asking. I'll put it in there. I'll put it in there. I Maybe that's don't... why they like our vlogs, because we're not Well, perfect. the we other day I talked videos. about having like almost a social anxiety attack from Costco, because everybody's so mean. Dude, have you guys been to Costco? Comment down below and let us know. But Well, I was walking sometimes. through there and I was like freaking out because everyone's so mean. They're shoving you around. I didn't have my husband with me. Well, and then they to, like be a blocker and to make me feel better. <laughs> then they mess with you with those big carts. Yeah. Like that's not because you're gonna buy bigger items. That's like because you you like naturally sometimes people just fill up their cart and they're like, well, if we have a cart that's twice the size of a normal cart because oh, this I is America, think... remember? I thought it was just because you know some of those things are bigger. Like, yeah, I mean maybe to some extent, but I think there's some psychological trickery. With Trickery. The bigger cart, you'll put more stuff in it. Yeah. You know? What do you think? Comment down below. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to get some <laughs> dinner at this little tiny Italian place that has been here for probably 110 years. Not 110. Maybe like 60. Yeah, I'd, I'd say at least 60. It's like one of the last. Because my mom went there when she was in high school. And she is 39. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My mom's 39 too. Yeah. They both look great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so what, 40 years then? 40, maybe 50 years? We'll look and let you guys know after there. Yeah. We'll show you some footage of it, But too. they don't have, like, different spice levels, though. It they is have, straight, like, one sauce with meat, you pick, without meat. Yeah, you pick your pasta, you pick your meat, and you get a sauce. I and it's, it's one good. sauce. But anyway, so we it's both... Really good. Well, they have the best cannolis in the world. Cool. We so have to get like we both, six of them when we leave. Even if the pasta wasn't good, we would yeah, tell they you have, that it's good because we want to go there again and eat the cannolis. Yeah, we've been there a few times. Like, plus, it's not expensive. Especially no. if it's like... And it's not... It doesn't take that long either. So if you no. screw up your pasta at home... Well, which I think we were which, making that I burned. Yeah, but I think it just threw us off because we were trying to rush and we did, did one of those I frozen. The oven off? Yes, we. Yeah, it's one of those frozen meals. Like we're good at making so regular we pasta. Make frozen. We shouldn't even be eating frozen pasta. Well, so. I thought I got it as like something easy know, for you to make. You well, we no. It was that, for when you were in New no, York. Yeah, that was for you to make by yourself. I know, but you want to know what I made instead? It was homemade pasta. See. Yeah. It you wasn't that good. Better. It was homemade. Well, it was see, so spicy. I, I thought I was just trying to make it easier for you, though. You know what I always do is I take the... I always add cayenne pepper and like a bunch of other you spices. You might put too much, though. Oh, and I don't <laughs> let it simmer or I don't realize. Oh, it's so yeah. spicy. It hurts. You can't put too much cayenne in there because especially if you let it simmer, Ooh. that's when all the spices get melt, melted into time. the sauce and then... Where were you? It was on your last business trip, too, I did it and I ate it. It was when you went to New York earlier <laughs> yeah. this year. Yeah. And I put so much cayenne pepper and then I made a bunch of, I made extra tons of it. Yeah. And then I put it in the fridge and reheated it that night. And then it, the whole I couldn't sauce even eat smelled it. together because oh, of the no. spices. Yeah, right? I couldn't even eat it. I couldn't even eat it. I had to throw it away. It was so spicy. I wonder, you know how you add sour cream to Mexican food though and to make it less spicy? I wonder sour if you could have done that to it. Maybe just add sour, sour cream. cream. For? I thought it was just to add taste. Well, it can add taste too, but a also that's taste. like a trick that people could do is you add sour cream to make it less spicy. Yeah. You know, it, it's not as, it kind of curbs the spice.
spikes a little bit. That's spice what. Curvage. That's why. Only people that can't handle spicy food eat sour cream. Yeah. <laughs> you can handle spicy food oh, now, man, though. I to when I to. first met Ryan, he could not handle spicy food. He ate food bland. I was like, what is wrong with this oh, picture? Yes. Everything's so boring. And now, like, I can't have something unless it's spicy. Yeah, so I, I can't, don't understand it. I can't eat anything without hot sauce. I mean, I think usually people are born to eat spicy food or not eat spicy food. I was born to not eat spicy food. <laughs> yeah, but you eat spicy food all oh, the time I now, eat, and I now you have hot sauce you all do. the time. Yeah. Like. We're on washer fluid. I need. Are we really? You have to push it in all the way. Oh, there it is. Yeah. He just put some in. Fr and he detailed triggery. the car. Your dad. He didn't detail it, he just fixed it. He did, he detailed it. He said he even vacuumed and cleaned it. He did? Yeah. I didn't know That's that. That's how much he loves me. Jeez, he loves you more than me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he detailed my car for me. Oh, so I was looking at, um, when I was at home while you were getting changed, I was on Facebook and I noticed like one of those suggested ads for our Malloy's blog page Yeah. came up and it was like, Ryan and Lindsay met in oh, I wrote school. that. I wrote that. When, where, I, but I couldn't find it anywhere on our page. I was like, how does Facebook know this? Send me about page. I couldn't find it on there, though. I'll show you. Oh, man, I was tripping out. I was like, Facebook knows everything. <laughs> Facebook knows everything. It listens when I'm not talking to it. <laughs> so anyways, that creeps me out a little bit. But anyways, so we're going to get Italian food. Yep. You people do your thing, and we will check in with you in a bit. Update. It's closed. Yeah. We're going to read the sign. Yeah. Oh. Now I just want cannolis, but nobody's <laughs> cannolis can touch their cannolis. No, nobody has cannolis up there. Uh, what are we gonna do? Pizza? And university does. Okay. Bye. Just had our pizzas and cannolis. Not as then it's not the same no. as the local place. Plus they like smother it with chocolate all over the top of it. Oh, it's so gross. I just like the cannolis to be plain. And good. Well, because that one place they have cannolis with the super teeny tiny little chocolate inside. Um, chocolate chips. Yeah. They're so good. Those were just like all you could taste is the dough. Yeah, it's just dough. All I wanted was the cannoli. Right? Oh, now we're all sad. <laughs> I feel like I need to cry. <laughs> oh. Those things are so hard to make, too. I think. I've got to figure out how to make them. We will figure it out. Uh, check out the local TDs. That is short for Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. Some sort of weird thing. <laughs> PJs. It's the TJ's. Boop. Hello everybody, this is Tillin. His name is Till, or Tillin. <laughs> what do you think, Ryan? You like, like my it. little air plant? Trader Joe's has had these things. Those are so cute. Very cute. What is it, cute and cuddly or just cute? It's cute and cuddly. Man, I'm still depressed about our Italian there. I know. I wanted that food so bad. Actually, I just wanted their cannolis. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, that's all I wanted. That's all I wanted too, it's just their like cannolis. Oh. oh man, but it's... I always miss this light. I go straight, it's green. But look how cute Tail is. He's so cute. 